Oh, look what the ribs did. She broke the toilet seat, look. Oh, I'm telling. Oh, I'm going to buy a new one. It's fine, though. I've, I've sorted it, look. I bought the best seat in the house. Eh, look at this. This is where things get a little bit exciting. Hey, Google, stop. See, so you can hear me. Unboxing the toilet seat. A very uh, f fancy, fancy seat. Because wait, wait to be impressed. We don't need the box anymore. We just need the seat. If I can just break through this wonderful plastic wrapping. Wait till you see this. So it looks like you're very you know, average everyday toilet seat with all the bits fall off and everything. Um, but, wait, we open one seat, eh? We open two seats, there's a third seat! So, oh, I don't know how it works. Oh, oh see, I'm, I'm just getting too excited. There's a third seat which fits in here for children to poop on, eh? Adult, child, me. So there are obviously, obviously instructions. Uh, you, you screw the bit into the thing, and then the watch it into the hoo do a bob. And uh, <laughs> we we know what we're doing. Eh? When you're a captain of industry like myself, someone who uh, you know knows, someone who's very delicate of hand, who knows exactly what they're doing, and you know don't even need that bit either. Uh, pff, I've got this. How hard can it be fitting a toilet seat? <laughs> I ask you. So, the, the, now, I'm not saying I'm hitting problems already, but I'm hitting problems already. There, there, there's, there's like five, there's like five holes in each, each of these bits here, right? Five, and there's only two of these, so I'm assuming this is like for spacing. But I haven't measured the the current shutter for spacing guidelines. I'm just gonna wing it. And go with the middle hole. Hmm? Yeah, always go for the middle one. So I, I may have retrieved the, uh, the guidelines, if you will. Uh, I mean, not, not that I'm stuck by, by any means. No, God, no, I'm just... So I imagine these are like the washer things. So they go on, right? If I, I don't know if I can see... Th so they go on, but they don't seem to sit. Like, it's almost like there should be a sheath there, but they just... Like, should they clip on? Because they're not clipping on. And they're just... That's going to free float. It's, you know, if I try and seal that down to the pot, that's just going to go... And I'm going to have the thing sitting like damn that. Now, I can't have it sitting like damn that. I need it sitting like damn that. Right. Turns out, these take forever to screw on. I'm not even sure what they're for. But according to this thing... I'm waiting, you're waiting. So, I've done one. Great. Turns out, there's two of them. Finally there. Two. Two of them on. So now. Now. Uh, I've got to take the old toilet off first. Seat off first. That wouldn't be, that wouldn't be a bad plan. Because I think these then. Which way do they, do they go this way? Oh there's even more screwing. 
If you'll excuse me, dog, I've got a very important business to get on with. Very important business to get on with. I'm gonna go up the stairs. Uh, oh, gate, gate, gate. Up the stairs, covered in wellies and kids' boots. And I'm gonna take that seat off and put this seat on. And there's gonna be no issues apart from these stupid washers. <sighs> so it turns out, uh, the old seat. I've just kicked the old seat in the stairs by mistake. So the new seat in the stairs with the three lids. Me, Bairn, lid. Did the flipping stairs! Right. So luckily, this one is attached with wing nuts. So I can see no problem with. This could do with a really good clean down here. I'm not going to lie to you, it's a bit. Uh, hmm. uh, I might have to wash my hands before my sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> Hello! Still doing this. I don't, I don't think the whole thing's supposed to come out like that. I think the wing nut's supposed to come off the bottom of the rusty. And then that's right. I think I'm, <laughs> I'm really bored. So, I have to get the other, the other nut. On the other side, as you can imagine, this is a wonderful job to be doing on your day off, is clinging around clatty shitters and unscrewing bolts. And, uh, oh, is that my toothbrush? Oh, oh, so. More screwing! I'm nearly there with bolt two, and that'll be the old seat off. Oh. Wing nut off. Oh, bits falling off. Old sea off! Is that got that broken and. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh! Oh! I might have to give this a quick deck for the clute. It's a bit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, don't have any spray here. Um, VO5 heat protect spray. I'm sure it'll be good for cleaning. Right, here we go. I'll, I'll take a dirt right off that bit, let's see. Oh, look at that! It's, it's like a new one! It's like, it's like a new one. Oh, VO5. Good for making your hair look pretty and cleaning shutters. So, yep, we're done with the old seat. Uh, that can that can go away now. Um, and good job. And new seat is going to go on. Eh? Go team! So, it turns out, uh, when you're measuring those five holes, that was in the back of the... Yeah, when you measure those, or you don't measure those, and you just go for the center holes, then, the funny thing is, they, they might not kind of just fit all the way down. You know, you might have to take those out again, and re-put them in a little bit wider apart, because that's just fun. So, uh, due to my miscalculation, uh, now, now I have to unscrew all these again. Yeah. Oh, look, look what fun we're having! Hmm? Not even halfway there! <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute, I've just realised. I've been unscrewing this bit here, and all I've got to do is unscrew the whole... the whole f thing! I don't need to unscrew this bit here, and I can just put it in, in a wider space hole. Hmm? Hmm? Oh look! That's a little bit wider apart now. See? And I can just mix sure it's and then I'm going to have to put this all the way back down again. For no particular reason! <sighs> See? Let's try it here. See? I'm not going to move that bit at all. I'm just going to turn this whole thing. Oh, oh, look at that, eh? <laughs> oh, this is much as magical, eh? This time, hmm? All like a glove. Not a problem, hmm? Now to screw on some more bolts. And with a few last titans off this bolt. Oh, oh, that's not right. Oh, this is another side. 
Oh, I, I appear to have broken off this bit. This bit here. From the other... Oh, oh, sugar. So let's have a quick look. Um, where is it? Oh, yes. Yes, indeed, I have snapped off. Uh, said, oh, <laughs> don't tell the wife. As you can see, a professional job done there. You know, one seat, uh, two for the children, and your final lead seat, all secure, you know, comfortable, shiny. Uh, we'll forget about that, we'll set that over beside the, uh, the premium uh, aftershaves. Ladies, I am married, just so you know. Uh, sorry, taken. Um, so yeah, that, you know, that, that's apart from one minor little problem, job done, or jobby done, if you will, because it's a toilet. <laughs> so I think the lesson we've all learned today, folks, is when you're fitting a toilet seat, uh, A, follow the instructions, uh, not that I needed to because I'm a professional, uh, B, Ensure ensure that the area has been measured thoroughly before you you know before you uh, Stick the, the pins in because they take ages to wind up little things on and um, B don't be too thorough in securing the securing bolts for fear of uh, Breaking them and thus, you know your brand new expensive two-seater toilet seat is perhaps not at its peak um, although it's all working, it's all fit, it's all fine. So I'm now having myself a celebratory uh, Coke Zero with Cherry and a Baby Bell. Which, uh, oh, because I've been hard working today. A lot of running about, fitting lavish seats. And I've just realised I should maybe have washed my hands before having said, Baby Bell, um, <laughs> oh, that's a, that's a listeria right there. Mm-hmm.